places that you can buy parchment. John Neal Bookseller, excellent place to buy parchment. Uh, Pergamena, fantastic place to buy parchment. Uh, John Neal, I believe, is in either North or South Carolina. Uh, Pergamena is out of Eastern New York. You can buy it from Etsy. You know, just go on Etsy and search parchment or vellum. Um, sometimes you'll have to say calf or deer or goat or whatever. Um, you can get it from Bee and Elephant, which is run by Nicola Beese, who is an Ethel Mark Skadian. She has very reasonable prices, and she has um, red and black parchment dyed in a period technique, which is fabulous. If you cannot afford to buy parchment, you can contact me if you are in the kingdom of Athelmark. So we have what is called the Athelmark Parchment Project, and the entire purpose of it is to put parchment in the hands of scribes who may not be able to afford to make that large investment offhand just to try it. We run through donations, so if you would like to donate to the Athelmark Parchment Project, you are welcome to do that. Um, we also, right now, I believe it is just me, and I only have a few pieces of parchment at this point because I made a book. <laughs> so I think that that about covers it. There is a gentleman out on the West Coast. His name is David Bianco, and um, he does exclusively sheep parchment. Uh, Nicola does sheep and goat, I believe she has done. I do predominantly calf and sheep and sometimes deer, but I don't like it. Pergamina does goat, sheep, calf, and deer. And I'm not entirely certain what John Neal has available. I know that he has calf, and I know that he has goat. I don't know if he offers sheep and deer. Um, each of the four types of parchment have their benefits and their drawbacks, and it's best if you try all four of them. I think that that's about it, and... There will be obviously a lot more to this class in the actual Zoom class, but if you have questions, please don't hesitate to ask them. And until next time, thank you for joining us, and I will see you later.